Hi, this is one of the OA in 2024, but it's just doing this for discussion purpose, so nothing else. So you can read over this by yourself, and then I'm going to explain this um, later. All right, you can pause, you know, the video right now and then try to solve by yourself. If not, then let's continue. Okay, cool. So this is constructor, and you have a pen method, contains method. So append methods take integer array, and then what you need to do is you want to calculate the three successfully element numbers, right? So the idea is straightforward. So I always use the I I always use three value together, right? So one, two, three. So this is this is going to be the integer array, right? One, two, three, and four, right? This is by default uh, they append this integer array. So you're going to calculate the sum of this, this is 6. Sum of this, this is 9. And then later on, you're going to append what? 5, right? And append 5 is just by itself, but anyway, it's append into the integer array, right? So this is sum of what? 12. Uh, 6, 9, 12, right? All right, anyway, okay. So the content method is definitely checking have I ever, you know, um, sum of, uh, find out the sum of this value before. So contain six, yes, I do. I I do have a number when I sum, uh, when I have it in the integer array, right? So one, two, three is going to be six. So you return true. Contains nine, yes, true. Contain, contains 12, true. So if you have any, you know, contains one, three, you know, and, and that any other number, you will return false. Cool. So, um, so the solution is straightforward. I'm just copy paste. I I don't really care about uh, the compiling. So I have a um, class for mo moving total. I have a nums one, nums two, nums three, and also hash set. Create as a you know, right? Hash set as an int, right? And then initial I set equal to no, and I declare the hash hash set. So append method take as integer array. I traversing every single one of them one by one. So let's not look at this first. So let's look at this. If the nums one equal to no, so it's gonna be like first value, first value inside the in integer array. Right, so first value is the integer array, I assign it. All right, the second one. Is, is second one, no, yes. Okay, I initialize this. Is the third one, so idea is you can just type. So if the third one is equal to no, yes, okay, I'm assign it. So once I assign it, I'm, I'm gonna calculate the sum. So I understand and, and I add to the same. So once I have it, so the first three value has already traversed. If I traverse the, you know, the fourth one, it's going to be this condition, right? Nums one does not equal to no, nums two does not equal to no, nums three does not equal to no. Then what I need to do is I want to, I want to uh, reassign the value nums one, nums two, nums three into a new nums, right? right? So nums1 will reassign to what the old nums2, and then the nums2 will re reassign to the old nums3, and then nums3 will assign to the current value, and then I calculate the sum. So this this is how I reusing my nums all over again, and the contain is basically say list dot sim dot contain and then the total. You it will return true or false, right? So this is straightforward. So uh, again, this is discussion purpose, so uh, just for practice. All right, see you later.